Man always strived for the best results possible when producing aeroplanes. The most important thing is to keep air resistance to a minimum and thus allow the plane to remain in the air with no difficulty. The technology employed in current day planes is the result of a hundred years of experience, experiment and research. Plane and wing shapes are designed with the help of computers, bearing a number of factors in mind. Despite this, however, no plane's flight control and technology bear any comparison with those of birds. For instance, no man-made plane can perform the same kind of aerobatics that birds do. So, who does this flawless design in birds' bodies belong to? Whose work are the physical structure and abilities of birds, which are so much more perfect than those of aeroplanes with all their scientists and engineers behind them? There is no way that it can be that of birds themselves. They know nothing of design or aerodynamics. They come into the world as unaware chicks and use the wings that have been made for them while they are in the egg. Even if they wanted to, they could not make their wings any different. The fact is that they have been given the ideal wings in line with their various needs. It would be utterly illogical to think that this design could have come about as the result of blind coincidences. There is no possible doubt that all the flawless design in birds' bodies is the work of a superior creator who made them. This is the art of Allah's creation. All praise belongs to Allah, the Lord of the heavens and the Lord of the earth, Lord of all the worlds. All greatness belongs to Him in the heavens and earth. He is the Almighty, the All-Wise. When birds' physical structures and wings are examined close up, one gets a better view of the proofs of creation. That is because there are important marvels hidden in the details. Birds' bodies are designed to be as light as possible and contain fewer bones than land-dwelling creatures. The bones they do have are also not as hard and dense. On the contrary, bird bones are actually hollow. Tiny struts diagonally positioned within the bones, however, make the skeleton remarkably strong. The most astonishing design feature is hidden in the feathers, though. These may look simple enough from the outside, but are actually wonders of design. Each feather contains thousands of tiny micro feathers, all lying diagonally. These micro feathers are joined to one another by microscopically small hooks, thus creating a light and perfectly smooth surface. This credit for peerless design in one single feather, with its thousands of tiny details, all invisible to the naked eye, belongs neither to nature nor to the bird itself, 
nor to blind chance. These creatures are just one of the billions of examples in the world of Allah's infinite knowledge and wisdom. When birds fly, they sometimes glide along by means of air currents. Yet there is one interesting species that does not rely on these at all. The hummingbird. The wings of these birds are yet another miracle of creation. Their flight systems are quite different from those of other birds. They beat their wings 25 times a second, and the human eye is unable to follow that movement on its own, but needs to see it in slow motion. Hummingbird wings, sharp and thin as knife blades, set up a vertical current as they flap. Man has done the same thing with the helicopter, which has blades that turn around the fixed axis and also create an upward air current. The hummingbird's flight system is very similar, although it is much more advanced and has many more controls. It can perform whatever maneuvers it likes in mid-air. It can go up and down or backwards and forwards by changing the angle of its wings. The way that the bird can beat its wings 25 times a second without hurting itself is also quite amazing. We can raise and lower our arms no more than once a second. If this were raised to 25 times per second with the help of a machine, then our shoulder muscles would burn and we would be left crippled or else lose the arm altogether. The hummingbird, however, possesses such a perfect design that its muscles suffer no damage at all, even though they may beat millions of times. This tiny creature is one of the most complex and superior flying machines in the world and a complete miracle of creation. <laughs>